All right, ladies and gentlemen, it's come to this. And hopefully I decide to test it to make the brightness a little higher. I try my best. Now, we reach the end. Select your story. We finished the hero story, and we finished the dark story. Now it's time we end it. This is the last story. What the? What's going on? Why doesn't the cannon fire? What? What's happening here? It's... It's my grandfather. Gerald Robotnik. What's that? That vibration? Hey, wait. Someone is coming. You... You haven't given up yet? It's all over for us. What do you mean? I just received a message from my boss. This space colony arc is currently approaching the Earth at an incredible velocity. It probably will impact Earth. What's that on the screen? This is a death sentence for every human being on Earth. If my calculations are correct, the Space Colony R will impact the Earth in 27 minutes and 53 seconds. All of you will be destroyed, along with your beloved planet Earth. scientific minds in the world, and my grandfather. What? I knew you were behind all this. Stop it right now, or else... I'd have done this a long time ago if I had the chance. What do you mean? You're pretty persistent for a hedgehog, aren't you? You're still alive, <laughs> Just huh? letting Knuckles pilot the shuttle on the way over here was more dangerous than you could ever be. What is this? This is my grandfather's diary. I don't quite know what happened or what went wrong. Was it a mistake to create the ultimate life form? I thought it would be something that would benefit mankind, but then the military guards landed on the colony that day. They were sent to destroy the research project that I had been working on. My colleagues at the research facility, my granddaughter, Maria, I hope you are all safe. The, the colony, colony was completely was shut down, down probably, probably to keep the to prototype, keep the prototype from, falling from falling into the wrong hands. Into the wrong hands. The Ark was shut down, under the premise that there had been an accident. I found Maria's name among those who died when the Ark was shut down. She meant everything to me, and I couldn't bear the thought that she died because of my research. I lost everything. I had nothing more to live for. I went insane. All I could think about was to avenge her. Somehow, some way, I got scared as I no longer was able to control my thoughts. All I could think about was that I wanted it all to be. Based on my original projections, I was able to complete my project, Shadow. I designed its mind to be perfect, 
If to you the wish world. to fill the world with destruction... Oh, so that's why you released Shadow from the base. The core of the Eclipse Cannon is now highly reactive and explosive. This is because the energy of the Chaos Emeralds is overpowered. If the colony collides with Earth, it will shatter into pieces like my grandfather pretty. That mad scientist! That should be you, right? We have to stop the space colony now! The space colony acquisition may have shifted due to the amount of energy given off by the emeralds. We have to stop the energy. But how? Hmm. That's it. There is a way to stop the energy. We have to use your emeralds. You're the one that told me that the Master Emerald has the power to stop the Chaos Emerald. That's right. If I use this, I just might be able to stop the Chaos Emerald. The reaction of the Chaos Emerald is moving toward the cannon core. It may be too late. There still may be some time left. If we pull together, we might be able to get to the shortcut that leads to the core. Then, let's get to work! That's a lot of exposition. Now we reach the final stage, Cannon's Core. We need to get to the colony's core! System alert. System alert. The intruder has reached It has begun, and yes, I took the liberty of finding their opportunity. Fine, we'll ignore him. Yep. Yep, this one's gonna require a lot of work. Why is that? Because everyone's involved. Sonic, Tails, Knuckles, Eggman, and Groot. You also notice that I took the liberty of getting upgrades. Rather, what's more important. works. That's better. That should be the easy part. Best recommended if you didn't as well. There, that completes the first part. Now we move on to phase two. I think I may need to raise the brightness, contrast, and brightness from this. Yeah, do it only when it attacks. Where his tails heads up? Rather, tails heads down? Eggman heads up. Nice. No, I 
got away. Step on it. Yeah, take advantage of those hour classes, that way you can freeze time and get a higher score. Now we gotta head up high. And yeah, that was my mom. Maybe I let my mom make a Yeah, our job now is the third phase. Third and fourth. This final map is gonna test you. And yes, like every other level in the game, there are objectives! Five each! I didn't mention this in my playthrough, but I may as well mention it now. Basically, there are five objectives. The first is basically the story objective. The second, you need to collect 100 rings. Doesn't matter how, you just have to get 100 rings and that's it. Objective three is to find the lost Chow. And you need to miss the penalties for that. Alright. The fourth one, you need to complete the level on a specific timer. Good job. Throw the switch and drain the liquid. We better step on it now! Because we're in the end game, ladies and gentlemen. Nuts. Are you kidding? Alright! That does it! That takes care of root! Now comes the hard part! Knuckles! You're gonna need the hour class for that. A 
Alright, that did it. Yeah, this is gonna one that's gonna require all their skill. This is why it's a team effort. I better move fast. Right on you. Now you gotta go all the way down. All right. That didn't help much. Yep. Come on. And now comes the last one, and you don't want to screw this up. God. Oh wait, no. When you lose a life, you don't have to worry about it. Your score is still the same. Sonic now! It's all up to him now. And here comes a bumpy ride. Why does this feel familiar? Alright, Lost World. Yes! And that did it. Thank God this game doesn't reset your score when you die. Because that only made things a lot easier. Too easy. Piece of cake. I try my best. Now let's find out what Shadow's up to. Oh, I hate it! 
it when they leave me behind. Look, it's Shadow. I really gotta stop whining. Everyone's trying their best to help out, and so must I. Shadow, we need you. Please help us. It's all going according to plan. There's no reason for me to help them. Besides, there's no way to save anyone. There has to be. I know that people fight over the most trivial things. Some people may be selfish, like the professor said. But they're basically good if they try their best and never give up on their wishes. They always have a reason to be happy. That's why you should help them out. Saving them is a good thing. Shadow, I beg you, please do it for them. Give them a chance. Shadow, I beg you, Fiona. Please, do it for me. Maria! For all people who live on that planet, give them a chance to be happy. I must keep that promise. That's what Shadow? Maria wished for. I've got to go now. I have to keep my promise to Maria. And you. Looks like Shadow now found a reason to fight. What's that? It looks just like the Shrine of the Master Emerald. They probably designed the core like the Shrine to harness the power of the Chaos Emeralds. All of you ungrateful humans who took everything away from me will feel my loss it comes. and despair. Prototype of the ultimate life form that was supposed to be encapsulated? Leave this one to me. Shadow, what are you doing? I'll take care of this while you run to get the Chaos Emerald! Now we fight the Bio Lizard, the prototype of the ultimate life. And this song supporting me is played. Listen. And if it is too dark, I do apologize. Oh, come on. I better make this count. And yes, every move you're gonna make is gonna have to count here. This is not an easy fight. Hunt. 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 
Shadow would have a penultimate boss like this. Looks like we're below half. This won't be easy, I'll tell you that. Are you kidding? I don't even get a chance to sum myself as a projectile is coming too fast. And now we reach this part. One to tell below half, you'll summon orbs. Jeez. Great. Oh, good, I get ranked back. Isn't near this entire area of the center of itself just like a Pokemon? Well, that was pretty predictable. And by this point, yeah. What? How'd I die? Great. Guess I gotta go through it again. The surfaces are designed to absorb attacks, but it's invincible. As long as he's equipped with our red light support system, he's invincible. Thanks for that. Like I said, I like this boss theme because of the music. And yeah, every time you have to run, you have to jump. At least keep a few rings. DS version of Sonic Generations. By this point, one that's helped off below half, that's when he summons these orbs. You need to use these orbs in order to jump higher. Well, 
Wait, that wasn't the direction I wanted to go. But okay. This thing really doesn't know when to give. After eight projectiles, you'll do this every time. Yeah, you just need to stand there. And now by this point, that's when the end game comes. And that's that. By this point, the cooling system's cooled off and you can deliver the final hit. Fun boss fight. Get out, you ugly prototype. are the seven chaos. Chaos is power. Power is enriched by the heart. The controller is the one that unifies the chaos. Only you can do this. Stop the chaos emeralds! Now we reach the final battle, the final hazard. With the theme song, Live and Learn. Yep. I mean, how, how awesome it is. Yeah, you have to use the A and B buttons to move up and down. You're gonna need it. I mean, when I first went through this, I really was shedding tears at this. This is awesome. Oh, go, go! That did it. We're past the halfway point now. This fight is easy if you know what you're doing. Too bad, but I'm better. I may not have 
not have played this game in a long time, but anyone who has played Sonic Adventure 2 should actually know what they're doing. Oh yeah, your rings are gonna get lower and lower if you're not careful. And now he's... Yep, he's not playing around anymore. Are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? Fine. Now I'm taking this seriously. And how exactly can I do that? How do you do that? How do you switch? I'll collect the rings. Now it's up to you, Sonic. Shadow, you need rest. Let me give it a try. Come on! You have a five minute time limit. Now he's not two cannons. Oh, nice. They actually did that. Like I said, just how are you gonna do that? You have a five minute time limit. I'll collect the rails. Now it's up to you, Sonic. Shadow, you need rest. Let me give it a try. I'm getting the hang of this. But man, this fight is tough, intense, and memorable for a reason. Gotta make every move count. Nice. Come on! 
Run! That did it! You got beat! Don't worry, we did it. Took me three tries, though. God, I love live and learn. Too bad Sonic X never had it. I must destroy all the evil the professor has created. This is what you wanted, right? This is my promise I made to you. Where is Shadow? Do you really think that the Professor created him, or Shadow, to carry out the revenge on all those who live here on Earth? He was what he was, a brave and heroic hedgehog, who gave his life to save this planet. Shadow the Hedgehog. I guess you're right. As a child, I looked up to my grandfather because of all the great things he accomplished in his life. He was my hero, and I wanted to be a great scientist like him. But... Did he really mean to destroy us? I don't know, but what I do know is... We all did it together! You're right. So what's next for you, Rouge? Off again to find those jewels you love so much? Nah, I think I'm gonna give up this line of work. Too much work for too little pay. Anyway, I've got something better than jewels that I'm thinking about right now. It'll all work out, you'll see. If you say so. Jesus, this is why I love this game so much. Not because of the fact that it can really hit you in the feels, but everything about it felt so perfect. It was a fitting end to the Dreamcast, and it also was a fitting end to, well, Sega as a whole. Because when the game came out, Sega was not in a good place. You guys already knew that, and I also knew that thanks to Matt McMuscles' What Happened series. Basically, Sega was actually going to go bankrupt. They actually were just going to call it quits and be done with it. Had that happened, maybe we wouldn't be seeing Sega now in 2022. Sonic is in a better place. 
but I only wish Sonic Team can actually understand what it means to make a good Sonic game. Because I felt Sonic Adventure 2 was the last Sonic game that had a lot of heart and soul. I mean that. What makes this really depressing is that everything after was a bit of a hit and miss. Sonic 2006 notwithstanding, because that was worse. I kid you not. But overall, I had a lot of fun playing Sonic Adventure 2 Battle. Fitting that today, that this year marks the 20th anniversary. Thank you, Mr. Okawa. Wherever you are now, I hope you're at peace. That is it for my playthrough of Sonic Adventure 2. If you enjoy it, please be sure to hit the like, comment, share, subscribe, and click the bell. I'll catch you on the flip side. This is Mega Man NG signing off. Peace out. See you next time, and thank you. A new day brings new adventure. But for now, rest easy, heroes. Until Sonic Heroes, that is.